bouncing the girls with petrol and setting them alight. He says the group started talking about satanism three weeks before the ritual. Wagner told the court he was under the influence of drugs and alcohol and that his body was out of his control. It was a poignant moment in court as Wagner's statement was read. He listened attentively with his face down while his parents sat stone-faced. Kirsten's parents, though, were shocked as the grim details were revealed. Brown and Grammar, the second victim, was also set alight, recounted how co-accused Courtney Daniels had invited them to an alcohol feast. Grammar says Daniels mixed their drinks with alcohol. She was told to draw her name on a rock and forced to drink again. Minutes later, she passed out. Grandma says she awoke to Kirsty burning and screaming. A forensic pathologist told the court the logo wouldn't have survived their injuries. She died of complications from severe burning, which led to multiple organ failure. The case continues. Mangobam Kunu, SAPC News, Palm Ridge.